welcome to Academic Game Tutorials. In today's class we are going to learn in details about manufacturing economics, the mathematical problems on equipment cost rate, cycle time and cost per piece. We are studying introduction and overview of manufacturing. We will cover all related topics one by one. Before starting, if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, just click on subscribe and press the bell icon. Here, we come up with new videos on different subjects to make the academic studies easier for you. So, into the topic. Problem 1. Let's see a mathematical problem on equipment cost rate at first. The question states, a production machine is purchased for an initial cost plus installation of $500,000. Its anticipated life equals 7 years. The machine is planned for a two-shift operation, 8 hours per shift, and 5 days per week. Assume 50 weeks per year. The applicable overhead rate on this type of equipment equals 35%. We have to determine the equipment cost rate. So, how can we solve this problem? Here, the number of hours of operation per year H equals to 50 weeks into 2 shifts per day into 5 days per week into 8 hours per shift equals to 4000 hours of operation per year. Using the equation CEQ equals to IC divided by 60 NH into 1 plus ROH, where CEQ represents equipment cost rate expressed in dollars per minute. IC represents initial cost of the equipment expressed in dollars. N represents anticipated number of years of service. H represents annual number of hours of operation expressed in hours per year and ROH represents applicable overhead rate for the equipment expressed in percentage. Putting the values we get, CEQ equals to $500,000 divided by 67 years, 4,000 hours of operation per year into 1 plus 35% or 0.35, which gives us equipment cost rate of $0.402 per minute or $24.11 per hour. Now, let's look at another problem. This mathematical problem will be on cycle time and cost per piece. The question states, the production machine in problem 1 is used to produce a batch of parts that each has a starting material cost equals $2.35. Batch quantity equals 100. The actual processing time in the operation equals 3.72 minutes. Time to load and unload each workpiece equals 1.60 minutes. Tool cost equals $4.40, and each tool can be used for 20 pieces before it is changed, which takes 2.0 minutes. Before production can begin, the machine must be set up, which takes 2.5 hours. Hourly wage rate of the operator equals $16.50 per hour, and the applicable labor overhead rate equals 40%. Determine, A, the cycle time for the piece, B, average production rate when set up time is figured in, and, C, cost per piece. So, how can we solve this problem? Let's look at the solution of A. To determine the cycle time for the piece. Here, for equation of cycle time, TC equals to TO plus TH plus TT. Processing time to equals 3.72 minutes, part handling time TH equals 1.60 minutes, and tool handling time TT equals 2.00 minutes, divide by 20 pieces, which gives 0.10 minute. Putting the values, we have Cycle time, TC, equals to, 3.72 plus 1.60 plus 0 0.10 equals 5.42 minutes per piece. So, we have determined the cycle time for the piece. Now, let's look at question B. Where we have to determine average production rate when set up time is figured in, or set up time is taken into account, or effective set up time is also counted. We know. The average production time per piece including the effect of setup time is TP equals to TSU divided by Q plus TC where TP 
represents average production time per piece, expressed in minutes per piece. TSU represents setup time, expressed in minutes per batch. Q represents batch quantity, expressed in number of pieces, and TC represents cycle time as defined in the first equation, expressed in minutes per piece. Putting the values, we have TP equals to 2.5 hours into 60, which converts hours into minutes, divided by batch quantity 100, plus the value of cycle time which is 5.42 minutes per piece as we obtained from the previous question solution, which gives us a total value of 6.92 minutes per piece. Now, since the hourly production rate is the reciprocal of average production time, TP, correcting for time units, we have RP equals to 60 divided by TP, where RP represents average hourly production rate expressed in pieces per hour. Putting the value of TP, we have an average hourly production rate of 8.67 pieces per hour. So, we have determined the average production rate when setup time is figured in. Now, let's move to question C, where we have to determine the cost per piece. Well, we are in problem 2, but you must remember that, we have already obtained the equipment cost rate for this machine from problem 1, right? So, from problem 1, we have the value of equipment cost rate of $0.402 per minute, or $24.11 per hour. The labor rate is calculated as, CL, equals to, RH, divided by, 60, into, 1, plus, RLOH. Putting the values to the equation we get, the labor rate is $0.385 per minute, or $23.10 per hour. The cost of tooling, CT, equals to, the tool cost of $4.40, divided by 20 pieces, which gives cost of tooling of $0.22 per piece. Finally, after obtaining all these values, our required cost per piece is calculated as, CPC, equals to, CM, plus, CL, plus, CEQ, into, TP plus CT. Putting all the values in the equation, we finally obtain the cost per piece as $8.02 per piece. So, we have completed mathematical problems on equipment cost rate, cycle time and cost per piece. Hope this will be helpful. Thank you.